again welcome back to my channel it's Frances Brown Art uh, today I'm going to do a flip cup so a dirty pour and that is one of my favorite things to do because you never know what's going to happen so I've got this just a whole load of different colors and um, this is for a friend of mine who likes bright colors so here <laughs> here they are these are all kind of warm colors because it's a chilly time of year and so we want to be nice and warm uh, so yeah so I'm just going to pile up the colours into the cup um, in no particular order I kind of do a little bit light and dark so that it's not two of the same colours together and I think I'll do two rounds and see I'm, I'm doing it on and actually this is uh, this is Piano Concerto number no. 5 from Beethoven, so, you know, good old, oops, that's not coming out, how is that not coming out? These are, I'm still using the Arteza um, pre-mixed paints, because I got loads, and this seems to be blocked, so that's no good, is it? So I'm going to unblock it with my trusty... I think that flipped onto my face. <laughs> so whenever I finish painting, honestly, I'm completely covered. Usually it's quite funny, but it's good. I like it. It's my favorite thing is when I'm covered in paint. So <laughs> uh, I think a little bit more because this really isn't a, a large area and I don't want it to be too thick. I've been having issues recently with the paint being too thick and then I haven't been able to um, it's been cracking a little bit so that's no good is it I think I'm gonna leave it at that okay so this is the exciting part now because obviously vinyl have little holes in the middle you can see I've blocked that up with some blue tack so I'm going to turn that over flip leave it for a moment and meanwhile I'll ask you all how you're doing I hope everyone's well and keeping warm it's been absolutely pouring down today in the UK this is actually for an American friend of mine that I'm doing this so is it all done well we're gonna see so I'm gonna open the cup and then I'm gonna kind of spread it round all right then are we ready Oh, pretty. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get a little stick just to get all of the paint out. I'm very much a waste not want not kind of a person. And this will just help with the spreading. What I might do is I might thin this out and help it spread that way. that this is looking pretty already it's going to be very cool I think so what that does is just help it spread around okay so I'm going to start to move this around hopefully you can see it not too badly with the the um what am I trying to say the light I'm going to try not to get get it so that you've got too much of the light. This is possibly one of my favourite ways of doing paint pouring the um, the dirty pour because it's just colours just go where they want to go and it I've never done a dirty pour that I haven't loved loved so now I hope I've got enough paint because it, it is thick but this may take a while. I might speed this part up, so I'm going to speed it up and come back to you. Okay, here we go.
Okay, there we go. I reckon that's about done. Now you can see I had to kind of pull the paint down with my thumb <laughs> because it was um, it was really not forthcoming. It's, it's really thick. This is definitely thicker paint than I'm used to. Um, so I'm just going to blow out all these bubbles with my blowtorch um, and I'll bring you down for a close-up. I think it's beautiful. Here we go for the close-up. Now I've had to push, it's dark outside already, so I've had to push the light out of the way to try not to get the, um, uh, the light to reflect. So I'm doing what I can, it's reflecting a little bit. But you can see, um, and also on this side over here, I had to add some more paint because it just wasn't, it wasn't spreading. So I did another little tiny bit and put some more on. So if you don't do enough, you can always do more. If you do too much, it will obviously be fine. You can drip it, it'll drip off. So I will put this on when it's dry onto my Instagram at Francis underscore Brown underscore art. But in the meantime, I hope you have a lovely day and I shall see you soon. I hope you enjoyed this and sending you lots and lots of love. Okay.